I was finally able. With a different car, of course, because that stinking classic car that we used in the original video, it was proving to be too much on that first race. That Alpine course, it is not a good course at all. And I kept losing because of the fact that the blue car in this list here, CPU1 blue car, he kept winning that first event. Stupid idiot. But yeah, I finally got through this. And we have unlocked Space Shot 3 at Crystal Summit Lake. Right off. Alright, hello everybody. Welcome back to Burnout 2 Point of Impact. We just finally completed all goals in that one. And now we are able to do the Space Shot 3. So yeah, let's go. Also, I was able to get the colors for the for this car, so there we go. I just didn't think about this because I just hit A right after the colors, so it immediately went to the event, but when you highlight color, you'll be able to see the different color choices, so don't hit A thinking that hitting color will bring the colors up. Hitting A here will put you in the event, so there we go. All right, so what do I want to use for this one, though? How about we go with a little greenish color? How about that? Okay. <sighs> that took a little time getting that stupid first event done. Because I have to get gold. I can't just finish and then move on. You have to get all golds in the Grand Prix to unlock the next event. So, there we go. But yeah, here we go. Face off against this guy. I don't know what this is, but it kind of reminds me of a Super. Well, the back end looks like a Super anyway, but yeah. Also, this guy's pretty fast. Maybe I should have picked a fast car for this. But, stuff like that, he will crash and screw himself. So, I'm able to get ahead. Whew. Wow. And chaining the burnout bonuses is a big thing to do in this game. You cannot win by just going slow and steady. Especially in face off, because they are pretty fast. Whoop. Don't you dare. I don't know why the traffic cars just move towards the center of the lane each time you're close to it. And yep, here he is right here. Come, come on, car. That's one thing I don't like is how the car slows down when you grind the, the walls. I have a face off to win. I can't just... rub every single wall out there and expect to win. Also, I think we're going the opposite way in this course. And yeah, he crashed. That's awesome. But I really don't like this track due to the fact that there's so many turns. And it's easy to slow down a lot in these corners because you can rub the wall and slow down. So it's a little hard to keep up the boost. What? Seriously, boss? And that's one other thing I don't really care for in this game. How easy it is to crash. It's nice that they're crashing a lot, but not when I'm doing it. Hence why I don't like the Alpine track in this game as much. Although we have a little bit of a different layout in this one, but still. That first event in that Grand Prix, I hated that. And it is not a track you want to race in, in, in the classic car, that long Cadillac DeVille car. It is not a good track for it. Oh! You? I blame you. 
I am doing okay so far, but maybe I should have picked a faster car. Hopefully you guys can hear me okay. The microphone is not right in front of me. I have it to the side a little bit. I as close to it as I can get it, but I don't know. Also, while I was trying to do that first event in that Grand Prix, I had the M Classic plugged in as well, and there was too many graphical glitches, audio cutouts, and a couple times that the screen faded to black, or just went to black. So, I just, I'm, I decided that from here on out, I'm just going to record just with the Zedusha by itself. It looks good anyway. Like, obviously nothing would be better than an HDMI mod on the motherboard, but this is still better than just having it hooked up via the HDMI adapter basically an AV to HDMI adapter is better than that. It's better than straight up complicate or S video quality. This is basically the producer what it is, it's basically a advanced high definition um, motherboard. So they so it's like the oh like the official Microsoft high definition advanced AV pack, that's basically the component out. Um, the Gedusa is basically that, it just... They just added the HDMI to it, along with the Toslink, basically an audio cable, or fiber optic cable connector, so... That's basically what it is, and it's still better than the standard definition. This is still great. And I don't think Burnout 2 has 480p output, but it's still better than the alternative, so. The M Classic does help with the contrast and some of the colors, but the Gedusha itself is still pretty good, even without it, so. Yeah, there you go. Oh, you should have stayed crashed back there. That was awesome. But no, you decide to keep up with me. Come on, Carl, stop grinding the walls. We've got to catch up. I am not losing. Come on. Nope. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, Carl. Move. I do not like this track at all. Come on, car, move. I'm not losing again. Get up, get back here, dude. No. Come on, class. Thank you. Screw you. God damn it. No. No. No, 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 you are not. Although we're still away from the finish line, but still, come on. Yes, thank you for being a stupid idiot and stay behind me where you belong. Whew, that was nice. Chuck point. Okay, get away from me. Come on, come on. Don't let him catch up. Where's the finish? Where's the finish? Dang it. Ho, 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 ho. Don't hit me. Come on. There it is. There it is. Where's the finish? Oh, baby. Whew. Ah. Even with that little different layout, I still don't like it. I prefer the 
Burnout 3 and Revenge Alpine Tracks over there, stupid ridiculous. Okay, there we go. What? There was, a, there was another little graphical glitching thing. I don't know why. I really... I really hope it's not the Gadusha. Maybe it's the game. Hopefully it's the game doing that. Japanese muscle, really. Even though it looks like a super, which is not a muscle, but okay. But yeah. Okay. Wow, this is a pretty fast car. The most speed and control and pretty good acceleration. Wow. Purple. Okay. I'll go with that. Why not? Oh boy. It's heating up on the crystal freeway. I don't know what to say about that, but all right, let's go. Go away, blue car. I really don't like that blue car right there. That blue car can go suck it. And also, I don't like this truck. Did I mention that already? Yeah. Wow. Okay, the Supra. It has a lot of turning. Wow. It's got a lot of front wheel grip. It's acting as a front wheel car, yet the Supra is rear wheel. But still. Also, It does seem to have decent brakes, but, hmm. I think it has a little too much turning. Whoa. Although it did help on that instance, but still. You can really slow down quite a bit in this car when using the brakes. Okay, there we go. This is a sprint. Thank God. I don't have to go around again on this track. Whoa. Three straight burnouts. That's pretty good. Near five seconds behind or ahead of second place, but I don't know. Okay. And now we're away from the snowy mountain. That's what I like to see. Usually the snowy mountain is a pretty nice track to go through, but not in this game. This game, not so much. Second place is right there. Oh, I don't like that. Where's the finish? No, oh, don't hit me. Okay, good. We're oh, back in town. Or on the highway, but back in the city, which is where I like to be in this game. And there's the finish. How about screw you? Yeah, that's what you get for getting in my way. Becoming a potential target. And I... You were, you were the target. That's awesome. Okay. Whew. Alright, here we go. And what is next? No classes either. That's pretty good. Pursuit 3 on Freeway Dash and... A six event Grand Prix. Why are you doing this to me? Seriously, why? Isn't three enough? Four is pushing it? Five and six? Go away! Wow. I do not like that. <sighs> and freeway dash, okay, what do we got here? Looks like an old hot rod or an old coupe car from the past. And we gotta take it out with the cop, with the cop car, okie dokie. Kinda sucks that we can't change the color on this one, but. Oh well. Three, two, one, go! Oh, come back here, bitch. I got something for you. 
and it's called Buffton. Not a good name, I know. Okay, come on. Woo. Oh, don't hit that guy. Come on, get back to you. Come on. I need to ram you even more. Come on. Oh, you should have crashed right there. How dare you not crash? Come on. Oh, how do you like that? Hey. Hey. Stop going faster than me. Oh, yeah. Hit that. What? Oh, you sack of crap. How dare you hit me? Okay, three miles to go before he escapes, but he is not going to escape because he's an idiot. What? He sort of crashed right there. What are you talking about? It's like they just did a little love kiss and... What? That should have got him right there. What are you talking about? Is that a rapid heartbeat? Signaling that he's almost done. Oh, come on. I hit that guy. He just needs one more hit, though. Come on. There we go. Got him. An old coupe car. You can't get away from me. What do you... What do you take me for? I'm a cop. I always bust people. Woo! There we go. Fully unlocked pursuit mode from the main menu. Really? Oh, that car's a gangster? Really? What's gangster about it? When it said pursuit mode fully unlocked from the main menu, does that mean we're done with the pursuit events? Are there really just three face shop events, three pursuits, and four Grand Prix? I guess we'll find out after the next Grand Prix. So yeah, there we go. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time for more. Later.